Hi everyone, welcome to this hamster quiz. In this quiz, there are 15 questions and you can get one point for each question. Now, there are some questions that can have more than one correct option. And if you get half the question correct, in that case, you can get half a point. Let's start. Question one. Unsafe types of hamster wheels are A. Wire mesh wheels B. Wooden wheels C. Wire bar wheels or D. Plastic wheels A and C are correct because they can injure or break your hamster's leg. Question 2. Which of these shouldn't be fed to your hamster at all? A. Cucumber B. Apple C. Onion or D. Zucchini The correct answer is C. Onion. Onions are toxic for your hamster and apples can be given in small amounts. Question 3. Hamsters bathe in A. Water B. They don't bathe C. Sand or D. Mud The correct answer is C. Sand. You should never wet your hamster because it's very dangerous for them. Question 4. What color are healthy hamster teeth? A. White B. Yellow C. Brown D. Other color The correct answers are yellow, brown or orange. White color is a sign of damage or health issues. Question 5. Which hamster beddings are unsafe? A. Cedar shavings B. Paper-based bedding C. Pine shavings or D. Spruce shavings The correct answers are A and C. Cedar and pine shavings contain chemicals that cause respiratory issues. Question 6. What sand is unsafe for your hamster? A. Beach sand B. Reptile sand C. Sand with calcium or D. Chinchilla dust If your answers are A, C and D, you are correct. Beach sand is not fine enough and it contains many impurities. Sand with calcium is not safe because of the calcium. Chinchilla dust is too dusty and it can cause respiratory issues. Question 7. If hamsters are doing backflips, they are A. Playing B. Showing off C. Doing mating behavior or D. Not healthy If your answer is D, you are correct. This hamster is not healthy. This condition is called stargazing and common causes are brain damage, ear infection, genetic flaws, and stress or mental breakdown. Question 8. How many hamsters is it best to keep in one cage? A. 1 B. 2 C. 3 to 5 or D. Over 5 The correct answer is A1. Hamsters are solitary animals, so they are very likely to fight if kept together. There are some cases where even one hamster kills the other. Please keep one hamster per cage. Question 9. What is a good depth of bedding for the cage? A. 2 inches B. 5 inches C. Over 8 inches or D to cover the bottom of the cage. The correct answer is C, over 8 inches. In the wild, hamsters make their nests underground and bedding is used to simulate those conditions. Question 10. Hamsters front teeth A are replaced once a year. B continuously grow. C never grow or D can never break. 
The correct answer is B. Continuously grow. Hamsters front teeth are always growing so it's very important to provide them with chew toys to maintain their teeth. Question 11. Which of these are dangerous for a hamster? A. Grapevine B. Cotton C. Hemp or D. Hot glue Answers B and D are correct. Your hamster cannot digest cotton and hot glue if they eat them. This can create a deadly blockage in their intestines. Question 12. Can hamsters have food allergies? A. Yes. B. No. C. Only to fruit. Or D. Only to oats. The correct answer is yes. Hamsters can be allergic to anything, including food or bedding. Question 13. Syrians have two on each side, and wharves one on their belly. A. Belly buttons. B. Scent glands. C. Moles. Or D. Warts. The correct answer is B. Scent glands. They are used to mark territory. Question 14. Which hamster behavior is normal? A. Bar biting. B. Rolling in sand. C. Climbing the bars of the cage. Or D. Eating poop. The correct answers are B and D. Hamsters roll in sand to take a bath. They also eat poop sometimes to get vitamin B12. Question 15. Rocks can help with trimming your hamsters A. Teeth B. Nails C. Fur or D. Whiskers The correct answer is B. Nails. By walking over rocks, your hamster can trim their nails naturally. This was the last question, so let's see your results. 0 to 7 points, hamster newbie. 8 to 13, hamster lover. 14 to 15, hamster veteran. Hamster newbie. You're someone who's thinking about getting a hamster or has recently gotten one. Maybe, so far, you've thought that hamsters are easy to care for, but you're slowly realizing it's not that simple. Luckily for you, there are many forums, Facebook groups, YouTube videos, etc. that can teach you more about hamster care. Good luck in your hamster care journey! Hamster lover You're someone who has good knowledge of hamster care. You might not be a hamster veteran, but you know your stuff. You've been improving your hamster care continuously and you might have got a new equipment for your hamster recently. You're probably starting to notice examples of bad hamster care and you want to make sure your hamster is living a happy life. Hamster Veteran You're someone who has owned hamsters for a while. You have acquired vast knowledge of proper hamster husbandry by continuously researching and learning. You are the cream of the crop. Bad hamster care irks you to no end and you have no problem pointing it out and teaching people how to do it better. You might comment on YouTube videos with subpar hamster care. You are a true battle-hardened veteran. Thank you all for watching. If you like this video, please like and subscribe.